In this assembly video tutorial, we're going to show how to read information from the keyboard by using Linux system calls, specifically the read instruction. Okay, so let's go ahead and write the code that will read information from the keyboard. So as you know from my previous tutorial, the way to make a system call is simply by having the registers to have the right values in them. NetWide Assembler is going to complain of an error because I did not have the move instruction in front of the AX, BX, CX, and DX register as I'm trying to make the read instruction system call. So let's go ahead and fix that. Then of course let's recompile a program, link, and then run it. Oops, it looks like we missed the system interrupt. Uh, without this, the program won't run the way we expect it to. So let's go ahead and add the instruction to make the call to the operating system. Then of course let's recompile a program, link, and then run it. And now we are successfully reading information from the keyboard. The key thing to remember when you're making system calls is basically to have the right registers have the right values in them. AX register to have the value of 3, the BX register to have the going to be the keyboard. CX register have the address of the location where we want to store the variable uh, that we read from and to have the DX register have the number of bytes we want to read. Well that's going to do it for this tutorial. Please join me next time. As always please rate and subscribe. Thank you.